The following genome demonstration looks at one of the presets shipping with the product. We have a cylinder. We'll add from examples the Birch with screw options modifier. This creates a sine wave with an amplitude of 10. We can tweak this parameter and see how the vertices are being shifted in the XY plane relative to the Z axis. We have multiple types of waves. We can take the absolute wave, so the negative portions of the sine wave are taken as absolute value or taken as zero or taken as a negative value. We can increase the number of waves by changing the wave count parameter. And if we have enough resolution on the mesh, we can create a lot of these waves on a single object. And if we enable the create screw option, the wave will be also dependent on a rotating vector moving up the z-axis. This gives us lots of variations and if we stack multiple waves on top of each other we can combine them and produce deformations that are otherwise very difficult to achieve. In this case, we are just tweaking the parameters of two waves on top of each other, and we can create sculptures that uh, can be seen as a form of make art button. We can play with the parameters and produce completely new shapes and just save those that look pleasing to the eye. Obviously, we can go to any frame of the animation and change the parameters to keyframe them. Our object has a lot of polygons, so the playback is slightly slow. But you have to keep in mind that it has 200 segments along the z-axis and 90 sides. So this produces a lot of polygons in order to be able to express all these waves. We can unhide a couple of uh, more example objects. We have a teapot with a wave which uses the vertex normals instead of vectors pointing outwards in the XY plane. This gives us localized detail on all the parts of the object and we have a sphere which has two waves again on top of each other the one creating a screw and the other one pushing on top of that with more detail obviously we can create a lot of custom shapes using multiple bulge modifiers stacked on top of each other We can even disable the one and use the parameters of the second one to create a nice looking deformed sphere. <laughs> 